have a cool Dollar Tree haul for you. It is pretty big, I tell you, and I'm excited to share with you. But I'm going to change up a little bit how I share it. I'm going to lay it out on the table, and we're just going to go from the left to the right and go through everything. I just want to make it kind of quick as if I can and so that you can see what's out there and try to pick up any of the last minute fall things that you want because you know what? They're starting to put Christmas out and you know if the fall things are going to disappear. So if you're planning to do any fall DIYs, you're going to want to jump on that pretty quickly. So let's jump in. We're going to start over here on my left. Now, first, I do want to point out they still have some gorgeous flower picks, leaf picks at Dollar Tree. They have this beautiful bouquet. So, if you just want to pick up something that has some sunflowers and a pumpkin or a pine cone, you can do that if you don't need uh, to buy a whole big bunch. But I just love these. Anyway, but they're just really, really pretty and they're waiting for you. I did pick up some of these sunflowers before and they have a smaller size as well. I also picked up some of these cute pumpkins in this gingham type check. This orange color, you get five mini pumpkins. They also have these little tiny pumpkins that are wooden and you get eight. So I did get two of those. And then some little acorns that are ready for you to use. I did pick up another beautiful glass pumpkin. I just love these. I don't know what it is. And then this is also a place setting and a place for your napkin. So isn't that cute? I did get a couple of those. They did have these little pumpkins. I think I've picked up a couple before, but these are the little, I don't know, like a velvet type pumpkin that cover that. They also have some novelties and I thought these would be fun for um, some play around things. And these are some little bugs that you can play with and shoot across the room. Some little eyeballs and then some syringes in case you need something. And I thought you might, you know, like could use it to put things on, um, not necessarily just for Halloween. So, you know, you might need squirt something or whatever in a really tiny space. All right, then they have these really fun uh, loot bags, the pumpkins, and I love the candy corn. They also, I, they've had these before, but I like to use bags uh, a lot. So these are the ones with kind of the design on those. I like those. And then they had some wall decoration. And this is really cool because it gives you a brick wall in the background and for kids church I might need that so then if you just need a little bit of pumpkin or candy corn they have Brock's brand name Brock's this is a six ounce bag here and this is a six ounce bag here so if you do need that um, you can pick that up and then along with that they have these fun little sticks that you can use for different crafts and they're you know clean and ready to go and they do tend to fall out so be careful when you pick them up that you didn't they didn't start falling out before you actually left the store okay we're going to scoot down a little bit i did get two tea lights i i need those for a craft then they had these cute cute stickers i hadn't seen I love these pumpkins and they are like um, elevated. They have a um, dimensional uh, bit to them. So really, really cute. And these do too, kind of the pop out look and uh, fun stickers. So you get 14 here and 14 here. Then they have these cute bags and they look like burlap. And I think these were in the Crafter Square. Yeah, Crafter Square area. And, you know, like to take your craft somewhere or something. But what a cute gift bag. I think it's a gift bag. Anyway, that's my thought on it. So I did pick up a couple of those. They also had some different signs at this store when I went in. Some wall decor. I love this one. Very um, farmhousey and country. And then they had these cute placemats. And so I had to get at least one 
and this sunflower is just calling my name. So I had to get that one. They had these little decor decorations that look like coffee mugs. Happy pumpkin season, so I thought that was cute. And then they have these wood, um, wood they're calling them wood stems, but you can paint or put your own uh, you know, decoration here. And then they have the cutout of the pumpkin along with the hanger already on. They had this wood grain look, and then they had this black one as well. This one. Yeah. As we moved down, um, they had these fun uh, decorations. Home and Autumn I picked up just because I like the background papers and decoration to them. So I picked up Home and Autumn. They're really, really cute. And then I looked at the fabric and they had a couple pieces. So I went ahead and picked them up. Um, this blue and green check and then this black and white buffalo check. They also had some ribbon in the craft section. So they have home with the heart and then um, home come, ho home come, welcome, welcome. Oh, it's just where the, I was like, what is that? And then love and laughter. And this is a pretty gray too. Then for a craft I'm working on, I did pick up some headbands and some ponytailers, and I think these would work. Um, either one's gonna work just fine, so I went ahead and picked those up. That'll be fun. And then in the candy aisle for Halloween, they had these vanilla midges. If you haven't tried them, these are so good. And um, they just, five pieces, 120 calories, and they're yummy, 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 yummy. All right, I keep moving things over as we go through them. So they have the Christmas trees that to me look like Dr. Zoo's Christmas trees already out. The store was also putting out, um, as I was there, they were putting out some of the ornaments. And so I picked a couple up. These were too cute to resist. They had uh, some that you can paint. Cute reindeer, wouldn't it look cute with some lights on that? And then I picked up this little gnome here and candy cane, this little clay look. They also have out their fleece scarves already. And to me, these are fun for more than just a scarf, although you can have fun with them. I have a video where I added beads to one. It looks so cute, so maybe I'll try to find that and link it below. And then, did anybody else ever read Nancy Drew growing up? Well, I guess this is new. It's Nancy Drew and the Clue Crew, and they had number two. That's the only one. And so I picked it up. I'm going to try to collect these because I have a whole selection of Nancy Drew books. And I'll, I'll put a picture at the end. And then I picked up some sticky notes and some flags, some uh, notepads, the colored notepads, and some paper clips. And I like to use these in their new colors. So how fun is that? So that's my haul, you guys. And it went a lot faster this way. But I just wanted to share it with you, and I hope you have a great, great night. Thank you. Smart puppy! Smart puppy! Hi there!